Yes, of course there's something fishy about describing people's feelings. I try hard to be accurate, but as soon as you start to define such and such a feeling, language lets you down. It's really a machine for making falsehoods. When we really speak the truth, words are insufficient. Almost everything except things like pass the gravy is a lie of a sort. And that being the case, I shall shut up. <laughs> Owen, pass the gravy. <laughs> Once it's recognised, has the stamp of the Induke. Ah, John. I may call you John, mayn't I? Meet Miss Murdoch. Iris, my dear, John Bailey, one of the more promising young lecturers in the English school. Though I caught him out over old English grammar, his weaker side, I fear. A minor question of Anglo-Saxon syntax. But it's true nowadays of most young. <laughs> I mean, went down the wrong way. Yes, I like that. There is a right way down, of course. Amazing how most of us find it without even thinking about oh, it. Oh, I, I, I rarely think. If you think about it, you'll never find it. Best thing to do is hang on and trust the body. I do. 